Ladies and gentlemen, it's the rivalry that put the X Division on the wrestling map. Let's take a look at the history involving AJ Styles and Jerry Lynn. Division title matchup. Pretty obvious when you look at the statistics. The experience edge goes to Jerry Lynn. No question that these are the fiercest rivals of wrestling's hottest division. Can Jerry Lynn win back the title belt that he never lost in the ring? That's the question that we're ready to answer. The following contest is your main event of the evening and is scheduled for one fall with a 60 minute time limit. Making his way to the ring, he is the challenger. Weighing in at 212 pounds from Minneapolis, Minnesota, Jerry Lynn. It was one month ago. It was back on October the 9th when Jerry Lynn was scheduled to defend his X Division title against AJ Styles. Lynn lost his focus. He attacked Sonny Siaki. He re-injured his right knee in the process. Jerry Lynn was promised an eventual shot at the X title. Tonight he gets a chance to regain the championship that he lost without being pinned or submitting. And his opponent, he is the current reigning and defending NWA X Division Champion of the World, being accompanied by Mortimer Plumtree from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 212 pounds. This is the phenomenal A. him accompanied by his manager Mortimer Plumtree and tonight's opponent Jerry Lynn have been involved in the most heated, the most competitive rivalry to date. It began back in June when the two made it to the finals of our X Division Championship Round Robin Tournament and it continues tonight with the latest chapter and it still revolves around the X Division title. I'll tell you what folks, there is a lot of heat between these two. They have disliked each other for a long, long time. I, for one, am glad to see them back in the ring. But although, I'll tell you this, AJ Styles is lucky to be in that ring tonight because last week, the Amazing Red put on one of the greatest shows we ever saw and almost beat the champion. And we're going to get to see him back next week, Mike. Yeah, we have to mention Amazing Red and the incredible matchup as he came so close on so many occasions last Wednesday to winning that X Division title from AJ Styles and Red will return one week from tonight. 
right here on NWA TNA. You know, when I look at this matchup, I almost think that Mortimer Plumtree is the X Factor because in the previous bouts between these two, Jerry Lynn has been able to totally concentrate on AJ Styles. That's not the case tonight. Lynn has to keep at least one eye on Plumtree, and that has to take away his effectiveness against Styles. Well, Mike, I also want to tell you what else is going through Jerry Lynn's mind. He lost his shot for an NWA title last week to Siaki. Well, this is the only title left. He's going for it. I don't think he's going to let Plumtree interfere. He'll keep him in the, in the back of his mind. He'll keep an eye on him. But he's focused. He wants AJ Styles, and he wants his belt back, Mike. And we talked about Amazing Red returning next week. Consider this the winner of this matchup. Whoever either retains the title or wins the title, whether it's Styles the champion or Lynn the champion at the conclusion of this match, they will defend next week against Kid Cash, who earlier tonight won that tables elimination match to gain a shot at the X Division belt. And a lot of people have felt that Kid Cash deserved a title shot a long time ago. Well, it takes patience in the X Division, but he earned it. He earned it today by beating four formidable opponents, and next week he'll take on the winner of this match in another incredible X Division title match. That's why you've got to be here every Wednesday night, Mike, because you see the greatest wrestling you've ever seen, period. Jimmy Yang of the Flying Elvises returns one week from tonight, returns to the X Division. And I understand that there's a debut as well in the X Division next week, Easy Money, a wrestler that you're going to be pretty impressed with. I saw him for several months in World Championship Wrestling. He debuts one week from tonight, and he will be a great addition to the NWA TNA X Division. Remember that name, Easy Money, debuts next Wednesday. The two are just sizing each other up right now. They both know that either one can explode at any moment. Everywhere. Both of them have death-defying moves, like it's shown in that clip, gravity-defying moves. And what you have to do right now is just pick their spot, because once it gets going, Mike, there'll be no stop in this whirlwind. Yeah, early stages of this matchup, sort of a feeling-out process between the two. Both men tentative. Both men not wanting to expose too much of their offense until they've worn their opponent down. You know, it's been a while since the two of them have been in the ring. They've, they've faced so many different opponents, too. You know, you've got to re-familiarize yourself with the other opponent. Lynn coming off the ropes. Attempted a hip toss. Cut him with a knee. Floats over. Ducks the clothesline. Drops down. Sweeps the leg. Look at that. Went for the elbow. They are one step ahead of each other is what you're seeing here with each and every move in the arm drag. Surprise Styles. I'll tell you what, nobody knows each other in the ring like these two do, Mike. Phenomenal chain wrestling by both of these individuals trying to put moves together, but at the same time, each one, as you mentioned, they know each other so well, they are re-familiarizing themselves with each other. And they seem to be just one step ahead of the other, knowing what move they're going to make. The only time that Jerry Lynn has ever lost in an X Division title bout was when there was no X Division champion. That, when it, we crowned the champion. When we crowned the champion. Other than that, when Jerry Lynn became champion later, the only way he lost was a three-man match where the other person took it. So, like you said, he has never lost an X Division title once there's been champion. Styles swinging wildly in the corner doesn't connect, and that allows Lynn to turn the tide. And neither is AJ. Yeah, yeah, great point. Both these two, these are the two best. These are the two best. Springing off the middle rope, flying cross body. Leg sweep now by Styles for the cover. If you have to give out an MVP award, you're looking at the two co MVPs right here at NWA TNA. And it's just the way it is. Styles to his feet and immediately taken down to the mat with the running clothesline by Lynn. Lateral press, barely a two count. Just trying to wear each other down, feeling each other out here.